Hi guys, Philip here again. Uh, this review focuses on a new service called uh, Income League by Matthew Neer and Jamie Lewis. And I'm going to show you inside the members area and tell you what you get. I also need your help because I've spotted something inside the training uh, which I need your help interpreting. So stick around to the, till the end because I've got something that I want to show you um, which may be of interest because it, sh it may show that the training itself is very deceiving and uh, you are being uh, basically tricked into buying more upgrades and more stuff you don't need. Uh, so as always, this is only my personal opinion. I have bought the, I've bought the product, I've tried it, I've looked inside, I've sat through all the training to make sure it's of good quality. And so here is my opinion about uh, the Income League and uh, hopefully uh, you will enjoy my review. <laughs> So first of all, I just want to uh, point out, uh, I have just uh, uh, released my own uh, membership website where I teach, pe teach people how to make money online. So make sure you check that out, okay? It's uh, called takingaction.online. I'll leave a link in the description. So, Income League. This is essentially a, a, a training module where you learn how to make money online by, by using a very simple um, email marketing campaign and uh, by driving traffic to uh, simple opt-in opt -in pages uh, which you can create inside the membership area. Uh, so basically inside inside the membership area you are given um, a very quite a, a clever little piece of software which you can uh, integrate with your autoresponder in this case it's uh, get response and uh, you basically get this very nice simple but high converting opt-in page which you send traffic to and when people people sign into that um, uh, the the, the opt-in page uh, your auto your um, autoresponder starts sending emails you are shown how to set up the autoresponder. You are shown how to drive traffic uh, from places like uh, Warrior uh, Warrior Forum, Classifieds, uh, through solo ads and through uh, ad um, ad networks like Ad Hits, for example, and so on and so forth. Now that's where my first sort of issue comes into play because you, you know how I feel about solo ads, right? So solo ads are great if you know how to use them. They are great if you have a budget. They are great if you have an overall plan. Uh, but simply uh, churning out hundreds of dollars straight into an opt-in form as a newbie is, serves no purpose because a the, the the majority of the leads or email email addresses you're going to collect will be very low quality and b if you don't follow up if you don't have a long-term plan then it just won't work because um, yes you will make some sales but when you take the sales you're making in re relation to the amount of money you're spending on the solo ads in the first place, it's very difficult to find the balance because all you need is one unsuccessful campaign of solo ads which cost you a hundred bucks and you need to make three or four sales to recover that every single time. So solo ads is very dangerous for newbie affiliate marketers. Uh, equally for the traffic source, like for example the ad network um, method they suggest where you place uh, paid advertising on um, places like ad hits. Now that's, you know, that's fair enough, I'm, I'm going to run a trial on that as well myself to do like a, a case study, but when you are paying 0 0.07 cents per click, uh, it's cheap for a reason and when you actually go to ad hits and have a look at the, the websites they have on their portfolio, you very quickly realize that they are extremely cheap. They are extremely, they're all in the Bitcoin niche. They're all in the cheap and cheerful kind of very you know low quality websites. The traffic you are going to get is going to be very untargeted to, to say the least. And also they're most likely going to be a collection of bots and automated software as well. Uh, because these websites can't really be trusted and uh, I don't know what the vetting process is for companies like ad hits uh, I am uh, in the process of running a small trial where, where I do set up a simple funnel just to see how many leads I can get just to see what the open rate is and so on to see if, if it's actually real right uh, but the same principle applies okay if you send 20 30 40 dollars worth of traffic your conversion rate needs to be reasonable in order to recoup that money okay and also don't forget that you know clickbank has a 60 day money back guarantee so if you make a sale that money isn't yours uh, until that period is over right because if they get a refund you don't get a commission um, also, uh, the, the, basically, the, the, the training itself inside Income League 
is adequate. Okay, they, they show you a, a, a normal, reasonable way of making money online. Uh, but what they don't tell you is that the, the cost involved is huge. Because if you if you're brand new, you have no website, you have no brand, you have no YouTube channel, you have no personal connection with any of these people who do end up on your email list. Um, they have they are completely 100% cold. They have no idea who you are. They don't care who you are. All they're getting is some promotional emails uh, from you promoting ClickBank products. And also another th another thing to consider here is that when you actually look at the videos inside the training modules, when you look at what uh, products uh, Matthew Near and Jamie are actually promoting, you can see they are promoting all the, basically all the top selling ClickBank but ClickBank products. Some of which are very 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 low quality uh, products like the 30 Day Success Club. 30 minute uh, money methods, 60 minute profit plan, the AZ code, products I've reviewed personally myself before and they are all very, very low quality. They're, they're the same thing of a super highly pressured and emotionally driven sales page followed by a lot of upsell, upsells and inside the training you get a mediocre training uh, because they just, they basically, they want you to buy more products. They want you to buy the next training, the next training, the next training. They don't really care about giving you value because they know that you are going to keep buying, keep buying. Whereas whether or not you see results, I, I personally, I don't think they actually care because th these guys are salesmen. They just sell you stuff. Uh, they don't really uh, care about the overall value of the product because if they did, they wouldn't be promoting services like the 30 day success club, for example, uh, because they are very low quality. Now, obviously, that is only my own personal opinion. Okay, I've reviewed them and given my ver my sort of my look at them. Uh, some people might find them valuable, but I find it very unlikely. So that sort of comes back to the training, where when you see that somebody's promoting that kind of stuff, you have to think to yourself, well, if he's promoting that, what's the what's going to be different about his training when he's promoting that kind of low quality service? And that shines through because when you see the training inside Income League, it's the same kind of thing, okay? It's very shallow. They don't really show you anything at all. They don't really show you how to write emails. They don't, you know, you're not shown how to make a website. Everything is integrated inside. So all you're getting is an opt-in form and just one, like one single opt-in form. If you want the other ones, guess what? You have to upgrade, right, as always and you get uh, some very cheap uh, or very expensive traffic sources which are either very untargeted or just random or they basically are going to cost you a fortune and once you once you get the leads which by using the methods they suggest you're building a list which is super cold and you're not going to be making a lot of sales purely because even if you do sell something to somebody on that list, they're not going to buy from you again because the, the products that you're going to be promoting are so such low quality because they're ClickBank products. Okay, so you, you see what I mean? It's like a, a never-ending circle of you, your list is going to be churned and burned, churned and burned every single day. And even if you have have a hundred thousand people on that list, it's worthless because uh, they're not going to buy from you again and again and again. They might buy once, they might buy twice. But by the third time, they're going to be very, very shy and they're going to unsubscribe or block you. Okay, uh, because that is the nature of this type of marketing. Can you make sales with it? Yes, of course you can. Can you make turn a profit? Uh, yes, you can. But for a newbie, it's very difficult because there are certain um, certain mistakes that all newbies make. All right. Like writing rubbish emails or not um, nurturing their list or not understanding the principle of the mentality of people when they come to a sales page and actually following up with emails or giving value, building websites, building a brand, building a Facebook page, so on. And just stuff that you have to learn, right? Because you have to learn it. So but unfortunately, products like Income League are tailored for a newbie. They are tailored for people who want quick money, who think that it's going to be easy, who just want a simple done for you system, right? But I'm here to tell you that that is not how the online world works. You can buy methods and strategies which are enclosed in a certain area or a certain niche or a certain method, but you have to do the work. As simple as that, okay? Because you have to nurture your list. You have to provide value. You have to create content to provide the value. You have to, you have to do the work. 
So these types of services, they're tailored for newbies because people like Matthew and Jamie, they know that they are the only ones who are naive enough and inexperienced enough to buy it in the first place. Okay, at least that's my opinion. Uh, so uh, I've sat through all the training inside. I've uh, looked at all everything they show you. And in theory, yes, the training is valid. The training is good. The training uh, will work. But please bear in mind, if you do decide to use this, it's going to cost you a fortune. And the chances of your being successful are going to be quite slim due to the, the, the steep learning curve um, that you have to go through within the affiliate marketing world anyway, regardless of the training. So if you do buy this, please be very, very, very careful. Please, <laughs> I wish you the best of luck um, because I have one more thing to show you. Okay, now this is the, the thing I, I need your opinion on. Uh, because when I was inside the training, I spotted something during their click by click demo video. Now this is, uh, I, I don't know if this is true, but from my understanding, from my perspective, from what I've seen in this video, this is my interpretation of the following events. Now I think that they may have faked the sales they made in the live demo of this account. So if you have a look at these screenshots here, which I've taken from inside the video, this first one here shows you the time and date. Uh, it is the 21st of August and it's 6.44 p.m. Now this is where uh, uh, Jamie is creating a new uh, ClickBank account so he can show you uh, how to do everything step by step. Now that's totally fine, okay? Now the next uh, uh, screenshot here is from the video where he shows you, he adds uh, a link tracker to uh, the specific product or the specific advert called ads ad ad hits two, okay? You can see that there. And then the next video he shows you how to add this to Click Magic, uh, where you can track your links, okay? Which again, totally valid. This is normal. And um, but and again, look at the the the, the link tracking. There's ad hits two. And the next the uh, next screenshot here again, uh, same video. Uh, he shows you how to create the advert, and you can see there the advert is has the, the linking code ad hits two. And the next video uh, is an hour after the, the that advert goes live. And hey presto, he's made a couple of sales, like literally an hour later, right? Um, and which, okay, which is fair enough. That's unusually quick, but okay, fair enough. If, if that works that fast, then awesome. When he goes into his ClickBank dashboard, you can see that those sales arrived from Ad Hits 2, which is the tracking code he set up uh, a few minutes ago. And there's the, 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 there was one sale there plus uh, an upsell. So that's one customer who's bought it. And an hour or two later, he comes back and he shows you another screenshot of, hey, look, I've now made even more sales in just two or three hours since I launched my adverts. And from there, you can see again that all these sales are coming from Ad Hits 2. Okay? Again, awesome, right? That's, you know, it shows the system works. But here's what I spotted. The date on this is 21st of August, okay? Now, in the next uh, video, he then, it's the next morning, you can see that. Uh, it's now Wednesday, 9 a.m., and you can see it's the 22nd of August, okay? And he's made even more sales, awesome. But when, in that this same video, he goes back over to Click Magic, okay? And he shows you, he's just talking about link tracking and he's, he's showing you some other stuff. And here you can see, ad hits two, for, uh, up until and including the 21st of August, only had four unique clicks, all right? Four, four unique clicks on that advert, on a text advert, on a low quality ad network, okay? Think about that for a second. So he had four clicks and he made two sales, two sales, okay? So that's, he's, he got he got a 50% conversion rate on four clicks on cold traffic, all right? Now, whether or not those those clicks came from that advert, they went straight to the sales page and purchased, or they purchased through the follow-up email, which he only had one of. He had one email, okay, one follow-up email, um, and and uh, they purchased literally within an hour of <laughs> the advert being created, okay. And not only that, but those two people out of the four who purchased it bought a lot of upgrades, okay, $250 worth, all right, in commission. Now, so I'm gonna put this to you, okay? I, I've done a, a 
a fair amount of paid advertising, whether it's banner ads or you know banner swaps or you know whatever. So there's a few different things: Facebook adverts and so on, Google ads. And I can tell you that the the chances of getting four clicks in an hour from banner ads is very very reasonable. Okay, it's very very that's okay. Yeah, you are going to get that. But the chances of four clicks turning into two sales on this type of product, and not only that, but getting all those upsells as well, and not only that, but only getting four clicks, not getting 50 or 100, are is very, very unlikely. So for me, looking at this, my interpretation of this is that this was faked. This They they purchased those products, the products themselves through their own link just to show you, hey, I made money, look at that. And because for me, getting, if I sh if you look at this, li this um, image here again, this is the image of the text ad, okay? To get cl four clicks on a text ad like that, and then immediately get 250 bucks worth of sales is highly unlikely, okay? Um, so for me, my interpretation of that is that uh, they most likely faked those clicks in order to produce a video uh, which showed that they were making sales instantly using this income league method. Now, why would they need to do that? Right? Think about it. Why? This Matthew Neer and Jamie, you know, the, their success online can't be questioned. Okay, they are very successful. They make a lot of money. So why can't they show you real screenshots of them making money? Why do they have to do this? Because to me, it doesn't make sense. So if I've misinterpreted this, if I've looked at this and I've read it wrong, then please do let me know in the box, uh, in the comment section below, okay? Because to me, this doesn't make sense, right? It just doesn't make sense. And if something, if something doesn't make sense, it's not true. Because it, this, for me, to get four clicks, two sales, plus 250 bucks worth of upgrades from two sales, from a cold traffic, from a cold advert on some low quality ad network is highly unlikely. Right, at least that's what I think. <laughs> okay, so leave a link, uh, leave a link, uh, leave a um, comment below. Okay, tell me what you think, uh, because to, to me this doesn't really make sense. Um, so yeah, that is my review of the Income League. The training is okay. The methods they show you are okay, but you are not providing value. You are not uh, gonna be um, building a, a valuable list. This is cheap, cheerful, and it's going to cost you a fortune if you join uh, because they want you to buy the next upgrade and the next upgrade and the next upgrade. And you are going to be perpetually chasing your money, chasing your list, chasing more leads. And you are ultimately just selling low quality products over and over again to people who do not want them. Okay. Uh, so uh, yeah, if you can like and subscribe to my channel, I'd be very, very grateful. And uh, yeah, please do uh, leave a comment in the comment section. And if you want to learn how to make money online, then check out uh, takingaction.online. Uh, it's uh, my own uh, membership area where I teach you about the, the online world and making money online as an affiliate. Okay, so thanks for watching and hopefully I'll see you again in my next video.